Hey guys, what's up? So, Toby Stern, top best story tweets, Friday 7, 12, 13, and 14. The first tweet is called Kai, uh, all your batteries at a glance. So, you took a battery of your phone, your watch, AirPods, AirPods case, all from the lock screen quickly and easily. This tweet is called Diary, and nice theme inspired by Ventana, better, but better, much better. And this tweet is called iPadify. You can have access to some features that are exclusive to iPad on, on your iPhone. Currently, iPadify enables the following features. So, I look at any IP, iPad only apps such as Playgrounds or Photoshop using iMazing, iTunes, or similar. Um, native picture and picture in Safari, TV, and other places. And this is called Temporary Background Spawn. And kills app spawn in the background for 30 seconds or as soon as the background activity ceases. This is called Sentence Wallpaper. Uh, make your sentence background your wallpaper so you can change your sentence background to your wallpaper. This is called Music Channel and makes uh, extra use of the stock music app by enabling the hidden TV shows and movies option. So, TV shows and movies option are sourced behind the sources, users, patch, uh, purchase media library, and you'd be surprised at how quickly they load without the Apple TV extra fluff compared to the native TV app. This is called Calm and Beautiful First Sight. Let's choose a theme or a tweet that's called Etienne. And let's choose emoji port and latest emojis for iOS 12 to 14.4. Let's choose emoji port iOS 10 and up. And necessary resources for emoji port for iOS 10 and higher. Let's choose called Big Bang Ev, Power with iOS 13 to 14. So that's copy in your chat, browser, edit, Big Bang Ev menu to bang words to pieces, then take what you want to copy. Let's choose called QQ Spurry Terminal or Terminate Terminator. Uh, this was QQ's annoying CM show. This is called Search for Clubhouse. Free tweet that adds the ability to search or filter the current ongoing groups in Clubhouse by topic. This tweet is called Drain Check and monitor your battery using the Control Center module. Revolutionary layout editing for iOS. Yeah. This is called Mochi. Requires at least iOS 14. Compact music player for iOS 14. So it fits a crash uh, with bug when opening notification center. This is called Fox 4 Tools. Help a tool for Fox 4 Tweet. This is called Flip Convert. Uh, port Flip Switch toggles with CC support. This is called Circuit for YouTube, download YouTube videos, and much more. It's YouTube Plus Plus Alternative. This is called Starfish Beta, the long way redesign, almost here. So, sports iOS 14. Um, helps you design, well, redesigns the home screen with a beautiful new layout. Every detail of the design has been uh, missed closely, redefined uh, from how it interacts with your wallpaper to the gestures found throughout. This is called Yobon Evolution and S Utilities in the Control Center. This is called KB Stretcher. And KB Stretchers are a standalone tweak implementing the same keyboard layout fixes as Rescale 2. It's intended to be used if you choose to use a different resolution changing tweak, um, net scale, system info, etc., and suffer from a shifted keyboard. This tweak stretches your keyboard to appropriate size if you have a custom set uh, screen resolution to your device. So um, I don't know why you guys would need this because I suggest just using Rescale 2. If you use Rescale 2, you do not need this tweak. This tweak is intended if you use a different Resolution include you know tweak as a match scale system info etc. So rescale 2 works amazing guys um, It's definitely the best tweak to change your screen's resolution. And here's match scale iPhone XS mass display resolution for iPhone XS This is called magma pro and colorize your control center Next tweak is called Zenubra and Sports Iris 11 to 13 show number of install packages per repo uh, for Zebra. This is called Snoover Lay 2 and Snoover Lay Overlays. No snowflakes on top of the home of lock screen, wallpaper, and applications. This week is called Bazzy 2 and all right, this week is called Bazzy 2 and Ultimate iPhone XXXR Battery Icon Customizer Tweak. This is called Status Bar Mitts Twick from the Twick repo. Colorize your status bar icons. This is called Roadrunner, keep apps alive through respreens. This is called Tether Me for iOS 8 and up. Uh, enables the native tethering functionality. To your device, gives you the option to share data from a VPN or share Wi-Fi connection to USB. Also enables the instant hotspot functionality introduced with handoff in iOS 8.1. Also allows you to edit your APN settings. This is called the Close, swipe the Close look, um, look up dictionary view. And the Close iOS 10, 11, 12. So cut off iOS 10, 11, 12. Swipe the Close, look up dictionary view. This tweet is called D Image, start image dimmer. So imagine you are browsing Reddit or Facebook at night and someone posts a bright screenshot that burns your eyes. Which image was easy on your eyes? This tweet comes to rescue. Um, it dims images according to the brightness level that you set it for. This tweet is called YT Plus and it's YouTube Plus, better YouTube tweak. This tweet is called Lock Shut. And piece of salt through the Apple forgot to add in terms of security, new weapon against thieves, or forgetting your device at party 
uh, only for someone to shut it down. So it brings a new, uh, never before seen features like the face shutdown, enables the all connectivity to your device so you can track it down, as well as other features like authentication, um, the shutdown.